Well, more people are planning vacations as more Americans get their vaccine shots. And now some top doctors are saying they might feel comfortable traveling, but under a few conditions. Here's ABC's Gio Benitez. This morning, major news from the cruise industry. Royal Caribbean saying its newest ship is set to hit the seas in May from Israel. But this time, all passengers must be vaccinated. It's just one of the signs that people are eager to travel. And with the news that the U.S. will have enough vaccine supply for every adult by the end of May, many are already making plans. We're seeing a huge surge in demand, specifically for spring and summer travel, in the last two weeks alone. But is it safe? GMA spoke with six infectious disease experts, all of them saying they're optimistic about taking a trip this summer as long as cases continue to lower and with some some other caveats, the main one being vaccinated. These vaccines are highly effective against disease, particularly severe disease, and so that really changes the math about what we're willing to do. Dr. Natalie Dean, a biostatistician with the University of Florida, is planning on traveling with her husband and two young children. While her kids won't be vaccinated, she knows children can spread the disease, but points to the data that shows severe illness is less common among young children. In the state's reporting, the American Academy of Pediatrics says up to 2% of child COVID cases result in hospitalization. Dr. David Rubin with the Children's Hospital of Philadelphia says he's also feeling hopeful about traveling to see family this summer. My mother um, has fully received her vaccinations and, and it feels safer and with declining transmission that opportunity is open not just for my family but for many families out there as we encourage our loved ones to get the vaccination. All six of the experts we talked to agree that being vaccinated is the main factor for safe travel. And they all say they would feel safe traveling by plane while vaccinated and wearing a mask. For now, the CDC is still asking Americans not to travel. No word if that will change by summer with more Americans vaccinated. But experts say even with vaccinations, it's critical that we watch the numbers and keep doing the simple things like wearing masks, washing hands, and spending time outside. We've really turned a corner here and we can start making plans for summer and thinking about endpoints, which I think is important for the optimism of the American public. And our experts say maybe choose direct flights so you spend less time traveling and less time in airports. But we should tell you that all six of these doctors say that if there is a rise in cases at the time, they're going to cancel the plans they already made. So just keep watching those numbers. Gio Benitez, ABC News, Newark International Airport.